Problem 16. In a middle school mentoring program, a number of 6th graders are paired with 9th graders um, students as a buddy. No 9th grader is assigned more than one 6th grade buddy. So in other words, we know that the number of 9th graders and the number of 6th graders are paired in 1 to 1 pairs. Um, if one third of all 9th graders are paired with two fifths of all 6th graders, what fraction of the total number of 6th and 9th graders have a buddy? Let's assume that the total number of 6th graders is x. For 9th graders, that's y. So what are we trying to find here? We're trying to find here the fraction of the total number of 6th and 9th graders that have a buddy. Well, what is the fraction of 6th graders that have a buddy? Well, that's 2 fifths. So 2 fifths of x. So it's 2 fifths x plus how, what is the fraction of 9th graders that have a buddy? Well, that's 1 third y. This divided by x plus y will give me our answer, but we know we have to isolate one variable in terms of the other to simplify this fraction into a whole number, or fraction rather. So what do you do? Well, this is a one-to-one -one pairing. So that means the, num the fraction of ninth grader, or the fraction of sixth graders that have a buddy must be equal to the fraction of ninth graders that have a buddy. Otherwise, it won't be a one-to-one -one pairing, which is the given problem statement. So now we can solve it, right? Y is equal to six over five x. So this becomes two over five right, x plus 1 over 3 times 6 over 5x. This is all divided by x plus 6 over 5x. Now, x and x gets all canceled because everything has a term x. So what we can do is we can factor out x and then divide it out from the fraction. This now becomes 5 over, uh, actually this is 1 plus uh, 6 over 5, right, because you factor out the x, we have 1. So this is actually 11, right, 11 over 6. Um, no, 5, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, this, what, one, 1 plus 6 over 5, that's 5, 5. So that's 11 over 5. So that's 5 over 11 times 2 over 5 plus 2 over 5. That's 4 over 5 times um, 5 over 11. So you get 4 over 11. So your final answer will be answer choice B.